Wakey wakey, Bill. 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 Come on, stink bomb. <laughs> you need to get up. It's a beautiful day. Look, it's beautiful. There I just rang Nick the Vic because I hadn't heard from him for a while and we were trying to sort out a date to get together and so I rang him and he answered his phone and it turns out he's poorly now I'm really worried about him he's had a terribly sore throat for six weeks and he's having a full old x-ray blood tests and what have you tomorrow so hopefully we will know how he is you might not have watched I think it must have been day one of Marchmas. And I talk about Nick the Vic there. Um, Nicola, Nicholas is the, uh, he used to be the local vicar. Not that I'm particularly a huge church goer. I've talked about this before, but um, Nick was one of the customers in the cafe where I used to work. And um, I very much feel that my faith is very quiet personal internal thing so i have this lovely friendship with nick that had grown outside of the church walls so it feels to me incredibly special and genuine anyway i'm a bit worried about him because he's poorly so i'd like you all if you believe in the power of thought and prayers and wishes to wish him well and to include him in your prayers I can't take myself seriously. <laughs> last video this eyebrow would it have been this eyebrow or this eyebrow really difficult to tell anyway one of them looks bananas i think it's this eyebrow i need to add a bit there i swear my face is going wonky as i get older how's that Better. Oh, 
who's looking at my eyebrows anyway? Apart from me. I, uh, worst thing about, the worst thing about vlogging is unfortunately it wakes up that internal critic of how I look. Which, when I don't look at myself and don't do these videos, I, I, don't, I don't even give it a thought. I'm very happy in my skin, but doing these videos and editing them, I notice how offset my teeth are, how one side of my mouth curls up when I talk, a bit funny, how you can see my carp teeth when, I, when I'm talking, and how my eyebrows are wonky, and how I have a strange vein here on my eyelid, and all my crinkles, which I like. I like my crinkles around my eyes because it shows that I smile, but when I see them, I don't like them. Now, I'm not saying this to get people to give me compliments, so don't do that. Oh, no, now I'm thinking I can hear the mirror because I'm holding the phone against the mirror. I can hear it ticking. I don't know if you'll even be able to hear this. I'll stop now. And where's, where's the camera? While I'm waffling and rambling, just want to address the fact that I am wearing yesterday's clothes. Because, two reasons. It's not good to wash your clothes all the time. It's not good for the clothes. It's not good for the environment. Secondly, no one's going to see me today. And I'm just doing crawling around on the floor jobs and running about. So it doesn't matter. So I'm mucking these out. One more day. And now... I will show you this. I'm about to block my swoon cardigan wrap thing. I'll talk about that a bit later. But that swoon, I might have to get rid of it. It's done, it's doing me in. <laughs> Blinking infuriating. Just 10 minutes ago, sunshine, now rain. And not three minutes later, truly I'm not exaggerating, it is now sunny. <sighs> Let's just think of that as a, as a soft water extra rinse on the laundry hanging up. Currently raining. However, look at that sky. Look at it. There is blue sky over there so it's going to blow over but I'm going to cut my losses I'm going to bring in the washing as you can see I've picked Bill up now he's very sleepy we've got a little under an hour before the other two boys finish school so we are going to go to Waitrose well I am Bill's going to have a nap I'm going to get a few little bits and pieces and yeah, I'll get you a drink. A few little bits and pieces that we need. Also, Julie, my friend who was in the video yesterday, who did my ironing, 
she's buzzed me and asked if I was going to Waitrose. If so, could I pick her up a few bits and then call into hers to bathe her ear because she's had her ear pierced and um, she's a bit squeamish over things like that. <laughs> so, so I'm going to do that. I will bring you with me and, well, I say I'll bring you with me. I might record some footage, but if it's boring, I won't include it. Because remember, I only include the good bits, only the best bits. Well, that's not strictly true, because the day before yesterday, I recorded me having a paddy, didn't I? <laughs> Proper, well, it was a very mild flip out. Inside, I was flipping out. I'm hoping that the bang thing is processing now because I have done what they needed me to do for this stage. So it's back in their hands. Okay, we're here. I was just waiting for a lady to come out of a parking space and as she came out, I could see she had a flat tire. So <laughs> I've just been waving and pointing and she's going, what? What? And I'm going, flat tire. And she's going, what wire? <laughs> no, flat tire. <laughs> Anyway, all sorted. On my riveting washing line watch, <laughs> we're trying again. We're home from the school run, obviously, and <laughs> Margot, it's not food, it's not food. <laughs> How cute is that dancing baby teddy bear? I've got these hostas in zinc baths, which, well, it's not food. <laughs> <laughs> Box. Which, they're usually, usually slugs and snails are deterred by these ink baths but look you can see something has got in there now I believe it's because I had it too close to one of these and you'd be amazed how far slugs and snails can stretch therefore no leave I've washed and dried some eggshells and I'm going to sprinkle these all over the soil because slugs and snails don't like this on their tummies since we've been encouraging so many birds into the garden that's our bird feeder. Oh, you've seen it because of Toby. Um, I don't want to use traditional slug pellets, even though they say that they are wildlife safe. The ones that I use, I just don't trust it. Skeptical. Ooh, nearly fell over. Haven't really got enough eggs, eggshells here. I need some more. Isn't it beautiful, this plant though? Look at that leaf. Yippee! <laughs> Cooking and jewels. Oh. Hi, my name's Jules. I know. This is my Hello, darling. Oh, you're so beautiful. Cooking supper, watching jewels, and uh, I realised that I couldn't look more ridiculous. Let's hope nobody comes to the door because uh, <laughs> I look like Biggles about to take off. It's almost nine o'clock. I've had a cup of tea. I've had a little bit of ice cream. It does look like I've eaten the whole tub there, but I haven't. I've had about a third. I'm putting a loaf on. And I'm going to go to bed and answer some YouTube comments because I'm really trying to keep up, otherwise I get a bit behind and then overwhelmed. And I hate not replying, and I know I've got loads on one of my vlogs and I haven't replied. I think it might have been April vlog. So if you're waiting for a response, I will get there in the end. And also, um, if it was a question you needed answering, then just, Ask me again. Okay, good night. Mm -hmm.